The top organization for international airlines says Hong Kong's passenger traffic may recover earlier than expected. This comes after the government announced plans to import 6,000 aviation workers to give the sector a boost. Missy Mock reports. The International Air Transport Association, or IATA, which represents around 300 airlines, expects passenger traffic in Hong Kong to return to pre-COVID levels by the end of next year. That is three years earlier than predicted by its Director General Willie Walsh last month. He said the more optimistic outlook follows China's earlier than expected reopening. IATA praised the Hong Kong government for its move last month to bring in 6,300 aviation workers through a labor importation scheme. The scheme, which is expected to attract mostly mainlanders, is set to launch this month. Fred Lam, chief executive of the airport authority, said there were more than 220,000 arrivals per day and around 75 million a year before COVID battered the city. He expects the number of visitors to reach 80 percent of the pre-COVID level by the end of this year. It is currently at 50 percent. Aviation data collector Sirium projects Hong Kong as topping the charts in the airline growth market. Its projections show that from July to September, airlines have reserved over 6 million seats for Hong Kong. Maisie Mock, HKIBC.